Good run by Kavako. Good defending by Ford, it must be said. He tracked that with him. Wouldn't let the uh, county number 11 through. Maybe half a hint of a penalty. Not given, not claimed to be fair by Kavako, but it is a corner. Oh, it's in! It's in! I don't know who's done it! And I'm not sure that it isn't Michael Flynn. It was a deep corner. There were players arriving. And it's gone into the corner. And unless somebody tells me who scored, we can only guess. And I really don't know if that went direct in from the header or whether it went in. The header went across and it took another touch after it. What a great time to score right on in fact well into injury time at the end of the first period and Stockport County have taken the lead <laughs> Gannon oh what a great ball really good touch by Armstrong oh and Durkin oh he's done it brilliant play and oh, what a cracking goal and Alan Armstrong must take praise, yes, another great ball. And Kieran Durkin, look, his first touch looked to have taken him the wrong side of the defender. As the keeper came out, he squeezed it between the two of them, in off the post, and County, having been under pressure since the half kicked off, a 2-0 in front. Fifty-three minutes of this cup tie have gone and Stockport County 2-0 in front. And Kieran Durkin his second goal in a week. There'll be no keeping him quiet now. And that was a really good finish in front of the county fans. Kizza for power. JJ Marsden, even Tom Bennett might even fancy this. Kizza scored one from a just a little bit further out on Tuesday night JJ also oh! what a cracker what a rip snorting free kick that was that kisser did it oh what a great strike three goals in a week for Kieran Durkin and it's 3-0 to County, just when we were betting up here that it might well be JJ. Not after Tuesday night strike, that was a cracker. 3-0, and County must now surely be in the third round.